So I kind of went to go take the car for a spin and I was leaving O'Reilly's after um, checking on the knock sensor and I had left the parking lot and like I hit a little dip in the road and then all of a sudden I felt like my tire was just going to fall off. So I pulled into another um, parking lot down the road and... I mean, the wheel just felt like it was just legitly going to fall off. So I went and I looked underneath the car and lo and behold, my fucking con control arm, my lower control arm, ball joint had snapped into two pieces just out of nowhere. And the whole car had this mean gangster lean towards the front. So luckily it happened like literally fucking, I don't know. On the other side of that wall is O'Reilly's. So, I mean, I just kind of went and got the fucking part. And I'm waiting for my buddy to come with his jack. And we're just going to fucking do it right here in Starbucks. So, shit happens. So, we out here. We're going to have to change the whole lower control arm. Uh, Ooh, it, it fucked you up, bro. Fucked up the every... new axle. No. Yes. Fuck! It's okay. Well, that has the warranty. So, see, that little guy right there fucking just snapped. Fucked your shit up. So, we're out here changing that whole part in the Starbucks. <coughs> uh, getting the end of the tie rod that's still stuck in the bottom. Off, and then the new one should be going in. Why does this shit happen to us all the time? I don't know. I still think it's funny that this shit happened right next to fucking O'Reilly's. I know, right? Could, <laughs> and not in the middle of the fucking road? Oh, for real. That would have sucked dick. So the new one's about to go in all in one piece. Here is part of the fucking ball joint. Where's the rest of it? Huh? Where's the rest of that? Oh, it's right there. Here it is. Here's the bottom half of it. It's straight ripped right out. What the hell is that? Oh, it's a Like a glove. Put it in the hole. I know you're not good at that. I need to add some little hairs in there though. It's so fucking You sick bastard. Shut the bitch. Oh, that was a brand new fucking axle too. That sucks. <sighs> Whatever. That's why we have warranty. Aren't they lifetime on those? Uh, yeah. Yeah, fuck it. I just didn't want to have to pull an axle out right now. Go. There, 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 there. Go down. A little bit. Good. That way, that way we can use the fucking jack. I 
what I noticed. Fucking bouncing it off the rev limiter like every other K-series owners. Run, done, 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 done. Shift, damn it, shift. Shift before you blow my damn thing. Before I take it away from you, fucker. Okay. Uh, okay, where's the... Okay. Was it this one? No, it was... <laughs> <laughs> you fucking really used the C-clamp while I was over there getting... Hey, whatever works. I think Not. you can unhook it now and use the actual fucking tools that we brought over. So. I don't know if I'm going to return these. <laughs> I was like, I don't know if I'm going to return these. Well, they're actually pretty good. They come in handy, bro. Because I was going to buy those. Okay. Right there. it started out as a hookah session then brought the bear block that I was going to rebuild on we started tearing into that and now we're tearing off my old head off my old motor just because that's what we decided to randomly do okay, we're going to go register this in what's up bitch I like to hear how it sounds. 